that said, I don't really give a flying fuck about Tesla's automotive business. As long as it's roughly steady state and or breaking even, that's all I care about. The reason is because I'm focused on AI, autonomy, Optimus, and how quickly Tesla is able to scale both of these colossal opportunities. 15 years ago, as Amazon Web Services is about to change the game, go for it. We're going to show some video of the Optimus robot, but it's not all fun and games when it comes to this robot, because you say production of this robot could actually be negatively impacted by these uh, rare earth restrictions. Talk to me about that. When you're saying it's going to be impacted, would that slow down the ability of the company to produce them? Would it slow down uh, their ability to, uh, or excuse me, increase the cost? I mean, that's probably, if you think about over the next year, I mean, that is, you know, Optimus is going to be the game changer for Tesla. I don't think that this is going to in any way change the, the mass volume for 2026, but could, could it delay things? Yeah. And that's why for Tesla, I mean, Musk... Temper, you know, he's really 10% politician, 90% CEO relative to what he's done in China, needing to make sure that this doesn't in any way dent either autonomous, cyber cabs, or optimus when it comes to robots. 